I want to figure out how I can live my life, which requires me to do all the reading to understand, you know, Heidegger and Hegel and Nietzsche and all the greats until I have that button where I can download things in my brain, brain directly. I don't think my time there would be wasted training in that tradition. But the other thing is, it seems like, at least for a certain kind of philosophy, it's a lot about the subjective experience of man in a certain period of history. And so I wonder if there's just an epistemic barrier about what AIs can do in that domain. Those are two very good and separate points. The first one, I think, is a bit of cope. You can read Heidegger and Nietzsche, and many people will for historical reasons. I think in a few years, you could just say to your AI, create a dialogue for me with Heidegger, Nietzsche, and me. And I want to interrogate them and have them challenge each other. And I suspect you'll learn more that way than just reading Heidegger and Nietzsche. I've read Heidegger. I looked at every page. I'm not sure I learned anything. <laughs> I learned what it's like to look at every page and feel baffled. And I'm glad I did it. But we're, AI is going to beat that pretty soon.